Thank you very much. Uh, you know, audience peeps, is that a degrading <laughs> term? It is a degrading, I'm sorry. I'm just being selfish here. Ladies and gentlemen, with all the enormous amount of gun rights fanaticism that's going on in the country today, as a reaction, of course, to all the gun control frenzy, I could just see that soon, soon, the following infomercial will be a reality, an endless, incessant reality. Are you a white, middle-class, insecure male who's naturally afraid that at any given time, a veritable horde of Skittles-chomping, hoodie-wearing blacks will trudge in and threaten your neighborhood by acting suspiciously? Well then, the assault weapons package from Kilco Industries is your surefire way of putting a terminal end to that fear. The assault weapons package is a state-of-the-art, high-tech armamentarium that includes a Kalashnikov rifle, 10 hand grenades, 250 rounds of Kalashnikov ammo, and for those pesky governmental spy drones out to monitor and infringe upon your Second Amendment rights, an anti-aircraft gun replete with 50 anti-aircraft missiles. Are you psychotic? Well, you wouldn't be any more aware of that than, or nor concerned than any of your unconscious federal legislators. So your access to the assault weapons package is guaranteed. Are you a felon? Well, you'll not have any more a problem of getting your hot little hands on the assault weapons package than if you had bad credit. The assault weapons package is available to you with five easy installments of $2,000. It's not available in any out outlet such as Army Navy, Gun Shop, or Outdoor Pro Shop. In fact, the federal government pays over $453,228 for one. But if you take advantage of this special Kilco Industries offer, you'll pay just five installments of only $2,000. That $10,000 constitutes an over 98% saving. But wait, there's more. If you order within the next 25 minutes, we'll send you a brand spanking new, fully functional assault weapons package absolutely free. You pay only the shipping and handling. So that's two, count them, two assault weapons packages for $10,000 plus $10,000 shipping and handling. But wait, there's more! If you are among the first 10 callers, we'll send you a complete latest publication penned personally by the Board of Directors of the NRA entitled Gun Control Equals Gun Confiscation, a lesson in polarized thinking. This finely lithographed and beautiful edition, which is already a collector's item, has a 52-page foreword by the guru and good guy of gun rights, Ted Nugent. Remember, the, Christmas, the, the assault weapons package makes a fantastic Christmas gift to completely annihilate those holiday gift-giving dilemmas. Call now. Operators are standing by the assault weapons package. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry that I opened up with such a possibly quite traumatic, emotionally charged topic. Um, it may uh, interest you that, you know, this is the most def defensive, you know, hotbed of political football in our culture today. People are, you know, on both sides, there's these polls, you know, and it may surprise you that I am uh, actually a gun rights advocate. So. Uh, within reasonable limits, and so what I'm trying to say is, you know, I, I'm sorry for opening up for my own selfish reasons a bit defensively, so uh, to put you on the defensive possibly. In fact, what I'm trying to say is my own routine offended me. So uh, I don't want to torque it down because of that. I'm going to lead into a neutral uh, topic that doesn't hit you over the head so much, all right? 
Um, so along those lines, uh, let's talk about penis enlargement. Okay, all you ladies, stop laughing right now. Normally I like laughter, but you know you're not laughing at my routine. You're only doing so at the idea of making a poor man squirm to accommodate your ever-increasing demands for male length and girth. But this has got to stop. So my, my routine is educated. This is ruining the whole fabric of, of my television viewing, actually, because it has all these, you know, completely ridiculous <laughs> profundity of ads. And, and so, you know, so here it is. I mean, it rests upon three basic misconceptions, ladies. Number one, except for very gifted males like myself, who defy the laws of physics, okay, the more male protuberance length, the less the width. Okay, and vice versa. So you're not going to get everything you want anyway. Why wish for it? Stop. Stop. Secondly, a large body of scientific research has shown, you might laugh at this, you might think I'm trying to get a laugh, but it's absolutely, you can Google it after you get out of here, the absolute God's honest truth that all it takes to satisfy a woman and Asian males that the stereotype is true, should be really relieved about this, um, is an inch and a half. So, why do you ladies insist on adding another foot on top of that? It's unnecessary. And lastly, lastly, anecdotal scientific research indicates that, that means case studies of women screaming in agony, that about any more than about eight inches starts to become ever increasingly more painful. So ladies, be careful what you wish for. It, not, it might not be to your liking. But as it is, you know, this is destroyed. I'm trying to watch, for example, the seventh of deciding game of the NBA championship. I've waited a year for this between two, and it's being played between the Miami Heat, as you well know, and the San Antonio Spurs. Two of the most talented, unsurpassable, gifted scorers, defenders, quick, you know, so LeBron James, who I hate because he's proportionally arrogant to how talented he is. He's the best in the league and he's got an ego to be, you know, and all of the heat, I just don't like him. You know, he goes up to slam dunk. This is a critical basket. It may mean the game. And, and, and if he, it's blocked by Tim Duncan, Tim Duncan for the Spurs goes up with his enormous hand. His hand is one and three quarters the size of my hand. There it is to illustrate. And he goes up, and he's a big dude, as everybody knows. He goes up to block. He goes up to block. And do I get a chance to see what happens? I've waited for the... No, no. They cut to the 15th goddamn Postavac commercial in the last 10 minutes. And Now, who here does not know what a Postavac is, how it works? Raise your hand. Okay. That makes two of us, because I don't know how a penis pump works. What are they pumping up there? Air? Water? Sounds like a pretty painful price for a guy to pay just to have a bigger schlong. Okay? And by the way, I broke down the word. Here it is, my last sentence. You know, it's post. It goes up a guy's ass. The posterior. The posterior. Okay? And they're not pumping up anything. They're sucking out. Post evac. What are they sucking out? A guy's gonads? My God, thank you very much. You've been a great one.